What is up everybody? Welcome back to another video. Johnny coming at you with some TTM returns. Guys, for those of you that don't know, TTM stand for Through the Mail Autographs. I send out bunches of requests out to athletes and I report multiple times to this channel and to show off what I got. Guys, if you dig autographs, baseball, sports, and heck, just good vibes, hit that like button for me. Boy, that helps out a lot. Guys, I also want to share a blind trade from Alfred, which is a, um, a YouTube subscriber of mine that's getting into TTM. So we'll see what he has for us. And my last video, I forgot to show some of this cool stuff I got. I got to check this out. I got this Hall of Fame induction. Um, I guess it's like a like a, a magazine that, that this person went to the induction in, um, I guess, 2005. And I picked this up for three bucks. This is awesome. So um, I just... I just saw this with Wade Boggs' autograph and Ryan Sandberg. What do you think, guys? I think that's going to be cool. It'll be my first thing I'm sending out like a flat other than a baseball card. But uh, I'll figure it out. I think that looked really cool. What do you think, guys? Also, he also had this. Uh, Wade's, Wade Boggs, this guy was at at this uh, the Rays game where he hit his 3,000th hit. And this is it right here. And I, like I said, thought it'd be cool with some ink on it. Anyways, thought I'd share that with you guys before we got into the TTM goodness. Let's get going. We'll do the TTMs first. Here we go, guys. Uh, New York. Uh, New York. There you go. One of one success. Zero feet in only 28 days. Less than a month to get. Oh, <laughs> check it out, guys. Boom. Dick Perez. Guys, if you guys know the Donner's Diamond King sets that have been put out forever, this is the gentleman that is behind the artist. All right, this is the artist behind the magic. Whatever. I got this card at, uh, I think my buddy Clark picked this up. He found it. He found two of them at a shop, uh, at a card show we were at a couple of weeks ago. And he let me pick one up for very cheap. A couple, maybe 25 cents. I saw that he signed. And yes, he did with some beautiful blue ink. Mr. Dick Perez, sir, thank you for your autograph. Stoked to get that one back. I love Diamond King sign, no matter what. And they have the actually artist sign. Uh, that's pretty cool. Anyways, here we go. Mobile Alabama or Mobile Alabama. It's a one of one success. It's a zero fee. Nine days to get. Ah, oh, sweet. Check it out. Three out of the four so far. Mr. I believe Andy Merchant with some blue ink. I sent first to Mr. Ed Ott. Then Royal Stillman, and in the last month, got the last Andy Merchant. Now, Jerry White, I believe, is a signer, I think, maybe through past pros. I'll have to check into that. I believe he is, though. Maybe five or ten bucks, but I will probably do it to get this uh, get this complete. Love when cards come back complete. Now, this card saw some damage on one of the trips, as you can see. But all three autographs are legit. So, Mr. Merchant, sir, thank you for your autograph on the 76 Catcher and Outfielder Rookie card. All right, guys. Next one. Coming out of Santa Clarita, California. It's a 2 of one success. Zero fee. Oh, man. A lightning fast seven days. Oh, and a note to boot. Check it out, Mr. Carmen Fanzone, Fanzone with some blue ink on her 1973 tops, playing for the Chicago Cubs. Got some blue ink on that. Very cool. Put that up. Like I said, he also wrote me a note. Thanks, thanks for writing. I asked him who his favorite teammates were, and he says my favorite teammates were Gene Hines and Jerry. Is it Moses? Stay well, and he gave us his autograph again, Mr. Carmen Fanzone. Thank you, sir, for your autograph. That will look good in my index collection as well. All right. Got some good ones here, guys. We've got a few more. Thanks for hanging in there. D.V. Daniels, New Jersey. Ah, here I know who this one is. <laughs> it's a two-of-one success, zero fee in 26 days. Guys, um, check out... Um, this movie, this is a movie about this player. You can go to Facebook and just search Reunion 108. 
It's actually a movie called Reunion 108. I probably will look into it. Um, but look at it. Check it out. Mr. Billy Sample on an index card, and he in, and he actually inscribed uh, Rangers, Yankees, and Braves when he and when he played for him. Very nice. Boom! Check it out. On my 1979 prospect card, had Danny Darwin signed Billy. Uh, sample was cool enough to sign, and yes, Mr. Pat Putnam does sign for a $5 fee, and guess where that's going out tomorrow? Yep, to complete it, so hopefully in a week or so, guys, we'll get it back. So, thank you, Mr. Billy Sample. What did he send? Give me a little note, Johnny. Good luck in getting Pat's autograph for the prospects card. Thanks, Mr. Sample. Kind of put a little personalization up here. Um, safe travels, Billy, and he dates it down here. And this is the Sports Illustrated 1987, I guess, article that was written about oh, Billy Sample. And last time I sent to Billy Sample, he sent me uh, the same thing with a different note on the side. So, very cool that they take the time to do that. As he knows, I'm wanting that, uh, that last autograph. So, Mr. Billy Sample, thank you, sir, for your autograph. Last but certainly not least, Quad Cities, Illinois. So, one of one success, zero fee, and a quick seven day return to get. Oh, mine. Nice. On my 1984 baseball USA team. Got a, been getting a couple of these kind of coming back. These look nice with some ink. Mr. Bob Gaffrey. Or Caffrey, I apologize. Caffrey, he's a catcher for the USA team. And, um, yeah, 1985, what was this, Fleer or Tops? Tops. So what do you think about the haul today, guys? Guys, I really appreciate you taking the time. And I love comments. Let me know what your favorite autograph is. Billy Sample's a great autograph. Got some really great uh, notes today. That Dick Perez is legit. Um, guys, let me know what you think. Thank you. Sub, I'm out.